that we pay for everything for you. Oh. I don't have a sugar daddy. I've never had a sugar daddy. I want a sugar daddy yet. I'm glad you know because I am what? Sick. You could never have a sugar daddy because you are not that kind of girl. Baby, everything I've had, I worked for and I've gotten myself. I feel myself on the ground. I'm Suzanne was the only contestant in Georgia pageant history to sweep every category except congeniality. And that is not something the women in my family aspire That's to true. anyway. It's really or hard. that when she walked down the runway in her swimsuit, five contestants quit on the spot. Yes. Or that when she emerged from the isolation room to answer the question, what would you do to prevent war? She spoke so eloquently of patriotism, battlefields, and diamond tiaras, grown men wet. That's really and you probably didn't know, Marjorie, that Suzanne was not just any Miss Georgia. She was the Miss Georgia. She didn't twirl just a baton. That baton was on fire. And when she threw that baton into the air, it flew higher, further, faster than any baton has ever flown before, hitting a transformer and showering the darkened arena with sparks. And when it finally did come down, Marjorie, my sister caught that baton, and 12,000 people jumped to their feet for 16 and one half minutes of uninterrupted thunderous ovation as flames illuminated her tear-stained face. And that, Marjorie, just so you will know, and your children will someday know, is the night the light went out in your time. Trisha, are you? Do you know what these are actually got to do with These are a little girl's arms. A little girl with twins, with legs, uh, with a head. That really, Trisha. She's a pencil. She's a swizzle stick. You can use her as a pool noodle. And now I'm holding up her arms. Arms. I'm um, at Pearl Harbor. We had our own Pearl Harbor here today. And me. I'm Ben Affleck. I'm Ben Affleck. I'm holding two fucking girls off. And you're Cuba Gooden Jr. Disappointing everybody. <laughs> I'll just talk about your face. You're ugly. <laughs> 